smushy. You're my smushy. You're my smushy. Can you give me a kiss? Oh, thank you for the kiss. You're perfect. Hi. Good morning. Are you bored? You go outside. Oop. Why are you chewing on your halter? Oop. Don't chew on your halter. What the heck? This is terrible. Hey guys. I am exhausted this morning. I woke up at 3.30 in the morning when my dog had to pee. And then I went back to sleep. Well, I should say I tried to go back to sleep to wake up at 4 a.m. to make sure I could get my stuff together and go to the gym before getting to work early so that we could uh, go pick up a horse for a client today and then we couldn't get the trailer out. So a lot of hustle this morning to not go anywhere. So yeah, I'm a little bit wiped today, post holidays, tired, trying to get desperately back in my groove. I am still kind of in my winter funk and then I'm out of my routine with all of the holiday stuff and I'm just trying to like get back in the swing of things. So hopefully I can kind of get around to that soon because I'm tired of feeling like tired and out of whack. Yesterday I had a little more energy, but then last night I felt like I got no sleep. So it is what it is. I'm not a great sleeper all the time. So this has been a little bit of a chaotic week at the farm. I'm hoping that I'm gonna make 15 vlogmases, but it is looking slim. <laughs> uh, this is number 11 out of 15 and it is December 28th. I think I'd have to do one every day and I don't know that that's possible. <laughs> um, anyways, this is kind of a chaotic week. Everyone's off of school, a lot of people off of work. Um, the ground was frozen the first couple days this week. I'm hoping to get horses back into work today but it's just been so much crazy scheduling um, with all of the normal scheduling. And then on top of that, kids being out of school and people being off of work and bah, I just feel like my brain is exploding a little bit, trying to juggle it all. So yeah, that's just kind of like my woes for the day. But moving on, I clipped a couple of horses yesterday because it was still too cold to ride. I think the high got to like 29 or 30 and the ring was still frozen. So Richie got a clip. I think I took a time lapse, I'll throw it in here. <laughs> And then I also clipped a client horse as well. So I might clip Z today, and I definitely wanna clean some tack and reorganize some things. I'm hoping to get some horses out to lunch today because they have now officially had far too many days off. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, five days? Friday horses may have worked. I can't even remember anymore. Saturday, it was so miserably cold. Sunday was Christmas. Monday, Tuesday, still below freezing and the outdoor was frozen. So just trying to work with what I got today, but let's kind of dive right in and see where we go today. I'm not really sure where this is gonna go.
Okay, I'm just putting some fresh stirrup leathers on my saddle today. These were clearance leathers that I got forever ago. But I've been kind of attached to them because they're this really soft, wide material. Anyways, fun fact. And I got some Devaku leathers and I let the kiddos break them in. But I'm gonna try these out, I think. They are softer now, but let's see if that's right or did I? Yeah, that was a little outside. Um, the biggest reason I didn't put them on my saddle right away, you'll see, is because they don't match. So I'm kind of on the fence about using them. I don't know. I'm just disappointed that they don't match. I'll be completely honest that... Um, I prefer just to ride and lunge horses, that cleaning on days that it's too cold to lunge and ride gets kind of old, and uh, I'd rather just be working with the horses, um, but they're all happy and fed this morning, so I needed to get some stuff done, which annoys me, but that's reality of life. I have to get in the groove of doing like productive vlogs in the winter time and not just thriving on the chaos. Cause I'll be honest, I honestly, I get a lot of like good energy and good mojo from the chaos. I'm just one of those people that kind of thrives on being busy and that's not necessarily always a good thing, but that's the reality of it so then when things slow down and i have to actually like make a plan and do things like clean and organize i honestly get like unmotivated and kind of grumpy about it because i would rather just be thriving in the chaos which again i'm not saying is a good thing you know i like to make sure i show the reality of everything on the vlog and some days it's too cold to work the horses and you need to be productive and I'm really stinky at being productive on those days. You know, when the day is just straight chaos, I actually tend to be more productive, I would say. But this is the harsh reality of what we have to do at the barn when it's quiet. Uh, we have to clean tack and we have to dust the walls and reorganize the grain room and do all the things that otherwise most of us probably put off. If you're like me, I have to be in the mood for those things. I also feel like every angle in the tack room sucks today. So I apologize. But the sun is coming in in such a weird way that it's making it kind of hard to have a good filming spot. So I'm gonna finish cleaning this tack and then um, which again, is actually something that most of the time I hate doing. I really need to fix this angle. <laughs> I'm really pulling apart today. No, not that one. Is that, is that straighter? Maybe. Um, and then I need to clean some of the wood in the barn, which I also hate doing. But it is too cold to work the horses yet, so we still have to be productive, unfortunately, whether we like it or not. And I don't think it's the best day to clip Z, so we're just gonna leave him put in his little outside world. Okay, I'm gonna finish cleaning the saddle and then we'll move on to how I clean the wood in the barn. It's a little frozen right now, but I use this Murphy's wood cleaner frozen but it should still work. I just put a couple drops in a bucket like so with a washcloth and then I fill it with hot water. So then it looks like this nice soapy concoction but it's wood oil and then I can literally clean everything with it. 
So hopefully you can see the difference. So on rainy or cold days, try to do this um, like once a month. I get a ton of compliments on how nice this barn is, which it's not mine, I just manage it. But I get so many compliments on how nice it is, but that's also because we do a lot to try to keep it clean and maintain it. So while uh, the kids at the barn are in winter break, this is something that they'll help me with. Goober to go outside. Yeah. He has been sharing his turnout paddock with his mom and he gets very impatient to go out after a certain amount of time, as you may be able to see. <laughs> okay. Busy day here. Me and the girls did some cleaning and we took some ponies for a hack. And uh, I'm gonna go try to lunge Z and that pretty much wraps up the day. So at least we kind of got into the groove and were successful at being productive. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go see if the ring is soft enough to lunge the scooper and try to get him to stretch his legs. And that's pretty much a wrap on today. I will see you guys next time. Thanks for tuning in as always to my somewhat boring daily life. Bye guys.